stop tolerating ankylosing spondylitis. Ankylosing spondylitis, if left untreated, may permanently stiffen the spine. Early hip involvement increases the disease burden and worsens the outcomes. One third of the patients experience function impairment which is reflected in work disability. Most commonly, symptoms begin with persistent low back and buttock pain. Most mobility and functional loss is experienced in the first 10 years of the disease. Increased disease activity, reduced functional ability and poor quality of life. In severe cases, premature death may result from cardiovascular disease and or renal impairment. Excessive smoking causes bones in the spine to grow and fuse more aggressively. Smoker ankylosing spondylitis patients have longer duration of morning stiffness, higher disease activity, poorer quality of life, less spinal mobility, reduced lung capacity. Smoking cessation is important as an early and aggressive treatment in ankylosing spondylitis because smoking increases the risk of heart disease and stroke, makes breathing more difficult, decreases the benefits of exercising, causes more spinal damage than in non-smokers with ankylosing spondylitis, exacerbates the pain of ankylosing spondylitis and affects the treatment plan. Ankylosing spondylitis patients who are trying to quit smoking must be patient. If their initial efforts don't work, they should discuss smoking cessation strategy with their doctor. Exercises for ankylosing spondylitis Warming up Always warm up before exercising. A warm up increases the blood flow to your muscles. It makes injury less likely during the exercise. A warm up could be using a bottom stair for step ups. Posture stretch Stand with your back to the wall, making as much contact as possible. Stretch as tall as possible without lifting your heels. Slowly raise both arms sidewards like this. Now slowly lower your arms. Repeat five times. Trunk side stretch. Stand against the wall. Slowly bend to the right, stretching your right arm down the outside of your leg. Now return to the starting position. Slowly bend to the left, stretching your left arm down the outside of your leg. Neck Rotation Sit upright in a good posture and hold the sides of your chair like this. Turn your head to the right as far as possible without letting your shoulders turn. Now return to the starting position. Then turn your head to the left as far as possible without letting your shoulders turn. Now return to the starting position. Pelvic Tilting Lie down with your knees as depicted. Tighten your stomach muscles and push your lower back down to touch the floor. Hold for a count of five and release. Repeat five times. Back and hip rotation. Lie on your back with your knees bent and your arms out to the side. Keep your knees together. Slowly lower your knees to the left. Now return to the starting position. Then slowly lower your knees to the right. Repeat five times with each side. Trunk rotation. Sit sideways on an armless chair in a good posture. Twist your upper body towards the back of the chair. Now sit the other way and turn again to the back of the chair. Cat stretch. 
kneel on all fours like a cat. Tuck your head down between your arms and arch your back like this. Now lengthen your neck, keeping your nose parallel to the floor and hollow your back as much as possible. Superman stretch. Kneel on all fours like a starting position of a cat stretch. Raise your right arm and your left leg and hold for 5 seconds. Come back. Now repeat by raising your left arm and right leg and hold for 5 seconds. Come back. Hamstring stretch. Sit towards the front of your chair in a safe posture like this. Straighten out your left leg and slide your hands gently down the front of your thigh. Hold the position for 10 seconds and repeat this time with your right leg. Hip flexor stretch. Bend your right knee and place your right shin on the seat like this. Move your left foot as far forwards as possible. Now bend your left knee as much as possible and hold it for a count of 10. Now change your position and repeat with the other leg.